Hello once again, Coast this is Alan from All Aboard to Roller Coaster page. Give her a like on Facebook, follow on Twitter at Pods Boys. Also, uh, for, uh, subscribe to us on YouTube. Give us a like and um, leave any comments, any subjects you want to speak about. Just give us a shout and I'll talk about them. I uh, just had an interesting information received to us uh, by a phone call by a good source, Paul Anderson. Uh, supposedly, Kenya could be on his way out. Yes, you've heard it here yeah, first, people. Kenya is on his way out, supposedly. Um, he's been turning up the meetings pissed. He's got a bit of a problem. Um, supposedly, there was a PR meeting with the board the other day, and Pardew and Carr and everybody was there. Kenya decided to go up on the train, get himself tanked up, go to the meeting mortal drunk. Uh, rang Pardew the next day and said, what time, when's the PR meeting? He didn't remember it. So, um, that's very interesting. It would explain a lot of things. Remember the two interviews at Talk Sport and um, Sky Sports News. You know, he came out, rang Sky Sports News and started talking shit doing the fucking phone to them. Um doesn't remember the name, so you must have been pissed then. And then when you when talk sport, he was pissed, getting every fuck his name wrong. So, you know, it, we, we was going on. It wasn't a mental breakdown. No, he was fucking hammered. Uh, suppose he went to uh, a meeting with Paul. No, he rang Paul Jew, sorry. He rang Paul Jew and said, Fuck, foreign strikers, I won Carlton Cole. He scored 17 goals last season. Uh, sorry, Joe, you only scored two, you fucking pisshead. Hey, then um, supposedly Darren, uh, Darren Bent's agents and representatives and all that said he turned up in negotiations, pissed as well. Uh, Remy and the Gomez deal, um, they've sidestepped them. They've just done it themselves. They've went in and done the deal without Kenya. So why would he need Kenya? So supposedly there's a rumour going round of um, where there's been a leak by a Newcastle insider that they're going to remove Kenya from his duties because he's not trusted. And now what I say to that is, fucking get in! Get the fuck out, you fat bastard!